Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I am Pratiksha Agarwal and today I am going to start a new topic which is syllogism. Students, I am going to teach you very smart ways to solve syllogism in which your success is 100% guaranteed. So stay tuned till the end of the video and if you are new to my channel, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Now let's quickly start the video. So I am going to start the video with some syllogism basics. Let's see what are they. So all A are B. All A are B means whole portion of A is contained in B. So it will be denoted like this. Okay. The second is some A are B. Some A are B. So it will be denoted like this. Uh, that some uh, portion of A is in B. Okay. The third is only a few A are B. So it will be denoted like this. Now uh, students you can uh, see that some A are B and only a few are B. A are B the diagram is seen. So to, to differentiate between two diagrams I have drawn this pattern between the common portion of A and B. You can draw zigzag or something anything you feel like just to differentiate between only a few A are B and some A are B. Okay. I hope this much is clear to everyone. Now let's move on and see what are the other basics. No A R B. So they are denoted like this, which means uh, there is no element, the element of A and B, no element of A and B are in common. Okay. The next is only A R B. So it will be drawn like this. Now students, I can teach you a trick uh, how to draw only only A R B is just when you are drawing this, okay? Just ignore the word only, add all after B, okay? Now read the statement from the back side, which says all B R A. You have to now read like this all B R A. Now draw this all B R A. Now, students, you might be seeing this uh, blue colored bars after uh, or your, you can say on the circle B. This is because uh, it denotes that no element of B can be shared with any other uh, circle or you can say if there is a third circle C, then no elements of B can be shared with any other circle and no other element of any other circle can be shared with B. The elements of B will remain in B only. Okay. I hope this much is clear to everyone. It will be more clear when we will solve the questions based on only A or B. Now let's see next. Some A are not B. So it will be denoted like this. See some portion or some element of A are not B. They so these these black dots are uh, referring to some elements and these elements are for circle A and A only this means. This is what this uh, statement means. Now students, let's see the questions for your better understanding. So this is question number one. Let, let me read out the statements for you students. All blades are sharp. Some blades are blunt. No blunt is a sword. Okay. So it is same as all A R B, some A R B and no A R B. The same syllogism basics which I've uh, which I've just uh, taught you just now. So let's draw this. All blades are sharp. So all blades are sharp means the whole blades are contained in sharp. The next is some blades are blunt. So only some blades. So you can see here only some blades are blunt. The next statement is no blunt is sword. So it will be denoted like this that no blunt is sword. I hope this diagram is clear to everyone. Now let's move on to the conclusion part. So the conclusion one says all sword being blades is a possibility. Now students we have come across the possibility statement. So whenever you uh, see uh, in the conclusion whenever you see the word possibility or any of the phrase like can be, may be, might be which are indicating towards the possibility then you have to see that this is the main diagram or actual diagram that from this actual diagram is there any possible diagram or any or can any possible diagrams be derived from this actual diagram so in this case, yes, there is a possible diagram and it can be drawn like this. Then see this, this 
आई एम शोइंग यू पॉइंटिंग यू दिस इज अ सर्कल ऑफ ब्लेस एंड दिस ब्लेस इज कंटेन इन दिस लार्जेस्ट सर्कल विच इज ऑफ शार्प ओके नो नेक्स्ट इट इज सेंग दैट ऑल ब्लेड्स आर शार्प एंड सम ऑफ द ब्लेड्स आर ब्लैंड एंड यू कैन सी दैट देर इज नो रिलेशन बिटवीन स्वर्ड एंड स्वर्ड एंड ब्लैंड सो नो ब्लैंड इज स्वर्ड सो दिस इज द पॉसिबल डायग्राम स्टूडेंट दिस इज नॉट द एक्चुअल डायग्राम सो फ्रॉम नाउ दिस इज द पॉसिबल डायग्राम स्टूडेंट सो फ्रॉम दिस पॉसिबल डायग्राम वी विल चेक कॉन्क्लूजन नंबर वन ऑल स्वर्ड बींग ब्लेड इज अ पॉसिबिलिटी सो सी यू कैन सी ये दैट ये ऑल स्वर्ड स्वर्ड कैन बी ब्लेड इट इज पॉसिबल बिकॉज नो वेर इन द स्टेटमेंट इट इज रिटर्न दैट देर इज नो दैट देर इज नो रिलेशन बिटवीन ब्लेड एंड स्वर्ड सो दिस कैन बी द रिलेशन बिटवीन ब्लेड एंड स्वर्ड सो ये कॉन्क्लूजन वन इज करेक्ट स्टूडेंट्स वेन एवर द कॉन्क्लू इन द कॉन्क्लूजन Uh, the uh, statement is like this or the uh, you can say the line is like that which is pointing towards the possibility the statements or you can say the phrases like can be maybe might be is a possibility or possible like this uh, like this uh, phrases which are pointing towards the possibility then only you have to check from this possibility diagram or the possible diagram okay and this possible diagram is derived from this actual diagram only okay now conclusion 2 says at least some blades may be sword so here when you come across the word at least in the conclusion part so the easy way to read this conclusion is just ignore the word at least read like this some blades may be swords now here also may be means this is also indicating towards possibility so we will check from the possible diagram so some blades may be sword so you can see here that sword uh, the circle of sword is in blade so yes this portion of sword which is in blade which is in blade okay this portion of sword it is is in blade so yes some blades may be sword so conclusion 2 is also correct i hope this much is clear to everyone you can see that sword itself is there in the circle blade so yes some of the blades can be sword it is a possibility okay so this is that is why conclusion 2 is also correct now here conclusion 1 and conclusion 2 both follows so our answer should be option number e in which it is given both conclusion 1 and conclusion 2 follows let's check see we got the correct answer now let's move on to the next question statements is are all flowers are white some white are beautiful okay so all flowers are white so they are denoted like this now some white are beautiful it is denoted like this now let's read the conclusion so conclusion one says all flowers being beautiful is a possibility so again it is indicating towards a possibility so let's draw a possibility diagram or you can say a possible diagram so this is the diagram which is possible this is only a possible diagram the actual diagram is this diagram okay whenever in the conclusion you see that something is pointing uh, towards or you can come you come across a phrase which is pointing towards the possibility then only you have to check from the possibility diagram now the conclusion one says all flowers being beautiful is a uh, possibility so you can see that all flowers are there in the circle or you can say uh, in the region of beautiful all flowers are contained in it so yes all flowers can be beautiful it is a possibility so this is correct the conclusion two says at least some white may not be flowers so uh, the trick i've told you ignore at least now read some white may not be flowers now here it is also may not be means also pointing towards a possibility so check from the possibility diagram so here you can see the area which i'm pointing these area this this much is not flower okay so yes some white may not be flowers so this also conclusion 2 is also correct 
okay i hope this much is clear to everyone students if you have any doubt please comment me i will solve it and if you have any question which you want me to solve then email me i'll provide you my email id in the description box so uh, students let's come back to the question here both the conclusions are correct so again the answer should be option number e that is both conclusion 1 and conclusion 2 follows let's check the answer See, we got the correct answer again. So I will uh, uh, bring more videos on syllogism. Just follow my channel, and that's all for today. I hope you like this video. If you have any doubt, please comment me. Thank you. Bye bye.